Hey, this is Chris Ravu with ASI. I'm here at ASI Fort Worth with Ryan Moore of All Me. And we're here to talk to him and because Ryan's company is really at the core of what we're seeing as a movement, if you will, emerging in the promotional products industry. And that movement is centered around sustainability, making more sustainable products in more sustainable ways and kind of tying that to corporate social responsibility. All Made, as I say, is at the center of that. Ryan's going to tell us a little bit about that. Well, it's been awesome to see more and more companies embrace uh, sustainable products or more sustainable products. We call it a path towards sustainability, environmentally friendly products because three years ago coming into the promo space, I've been in the print space for a long time and even that space, both is not really paying much attention to that. So a lot of people having more products with recycled materials in it, organic materials in it, uh, no matter what you're you know buying or selling, hats, uh, drinkware. So we, we're making t-shirts, we, we make them out of 100% more sustainable fibers. So, for instance, we're in Texas right now, so I love that. We should have like cotton from Texas, but it's not just any cotton. This is organic cotton. So, big hit with the Texas. Right? Uh, we don't use any chemicals or pesticides in this cotton manufacturing. Uh, cotton is a very thirsty crop, however. So, instead of using all cotton or like a 50 50 Modal. Modal is a tree fiber, so it's super soft. Uh, it uses six percent of the environmental resource base as cotton. So even if you're using organic cotton, you still use a lot of water in a shirt. And then instead of using oil, what we do is recycle water bottles. So we take a water bottle, we chip it down, and we turn it into a fiber like this. So this is actually ground up, shredded up water bottles. And so you're not using any oil, you're not using any chemicals, and you're saving about set 650 gallons of water per shirt. Plus, um, ton of recycling six water bottles for sure. That's incredible. Those statistics really are incredible. How much less of an impact are you now having on the planet, but still producing a fantastic product? And that's one thing that we should emphasize too: is that it's not sustainability at the expense of quality. It's still a ton of quality, and even a lot of it is more so infused into this. And after you can think about it, even if you make a sustainable product, if it doesn't last longer, it's actually less sustainable. So we try to make a good quality product that lasts longer, and then you're getting two benefits. We throw away so much clothing, and there's so much just trash out there right now. And then from a, a cost per impression perspective, you're spending a little bit more money, but when they understand the story and feel the quality, feel the impact of that shirt, it's going to last longer, they're going to wear it more, and the cost per impression is going to go way down. I was actually looking at one of the articles I think you probably wrote uh, about like t-shirts. T-shirts have the second most cost, like lowest, it's like one of the highest used promo items, but the lowest cost per, like, well, the lowest, like, uses. Yeah. Uh, people oh, yeah. throw them away. Yeah. You know, so better quality products will create a better return on investment for advertising. And, that, and Ryan makes a great point that that sustainability, there's a narrative there that your end clients can tell, that they're linking and aligning their brand with the sustainability narrative, and that is something particularly younger buyers who are coming into more and more power, they want to hear that, so it's, it's a lot of good going off your brand. I'll ask one last thing here, thank yeah. you for being generous with your time, just how do you see sustainability kind of playing out in the promo products industry in a, in a power space here in the next decade or so? I think we're going to have to trend towards it, and hopefully everything just gets done that way. That would go to economies of scale, hopefully bring pricing down a little bit, but also quality as well. So better quality, uh, maybe keeping pricing up a little bit so that people value what they're getting more often um, and having like a, a better overall return, not just for their ad spend, but also for the planet and their future children and generations to come. All right, great place to end. Ryan, thank you so much for chatting with us. Awesome, man. Thank All you. All right, brother. <laughs>